Good morning student. Today I am going to start new chapter that is chapter number 3 addition and this is video number 1. So students do you know addition means putting things together. So students I am going to start from your book I connect section. start student on the national festival of tree plantation called Van Mahatsa a school organized an event under the supervision of teachers the students planted 25 apple trees 37 mango trees and 17 orange trees how many trees did the students plant so here it is written apple trees 25 Mango trees 37, orange trees 17 and this is the sign of addition. So students what you have to do? Here you have to add these all trees. So how you will add? Start from one's place. So here 5 at one's place, again 7 and again 7. So what you will do here? So first of all, make 5 balls, okay, and here make 7 balls, again 7, make 7 balls, now count all the balls, so start from here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So students, here we will write 19 like this. No, if we will write 19 like this, then our addition will be incorrect. So see, 19, how we will write? Right side digit, we will write at 1's place and left side digit, we will write at 10's place as a carry over. Now again, students, this side also add. So here it is written 2, so make 2 balls. Here written 3. So make 3 balls and here 1. So how many balls are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And 1 carry over. So 6 plus 1, 7. So 79 trees. How many trees did the students plant? 79 trees. Okay. Now come to the next now solve some more addition problems. 5 plus 8. So 5 is written here. Add 8. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So here at the 1's place what you, have, you will write? Very good. 3. And at the 10's place carry over 1. So here it will be 1. So 13 and now next 46 plus 23. So start addition from 1's place. 6 plus 3. 6, 7, 8, 9. So right here at the 1's place 9 and again 4 plus 2. So 4, 5, 6. So here write 6. Now come to the next 7 plus 4. So 7 plus 4. 7 is here. And 4, so 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So at the 1's place we will write 1 and at the 10's place we will write here 1 as a carry over. So 3 plus 5, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 1 carry over. So here it will be 9. Again. 
3 plus 9, 43 and 49. So again we will do, add, we will start addition from 1's place. So 3 plus 9, we can do 9 plus 3 also. So 3 plus 9, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So here we will write 2 at the 1's place and at the 10's place we will write 1 as a carryover again. At the tens place 4 plus 4. So 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 1 carry over 9. Now students come to I read section. In the I connect section we recapitulated the concept of addition of 1 and 2 digit numbers. Let us now recall the terms used in addition. So students start term used in addition. So see. So students you already know that addition means putting things together. And one thing always remember students. That the operation of addition begins from the ones place. So 5 plus 6 is equal to very good 11. So here we will write 1 and carry over 1 at the tens place. So here no number 0 0. So here we will write 1. So see students. The numbers to be added are called added. So these numbers are called added. A, D, D, E, N, D, F. And C. And the answer which we get after the addition called the sum. S, U, M. Sum. Okay students. Terms used in addition. Clear? Okay. Now students. I am going to teach you addition of one digit number without regrouping and with regrouping. So start student. So start student. Addition of one digit numbers. So students, let us quickly recapitulate how to add one digit numbers without and with regrouping. See, addition without regrouping. Let us recall the concept with the help of some example. So start student. See. 3 plus 5. So 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So here we will write 8. Now 6 plus 1. So 6 plus 1, 7. Very good. 4 plus 5. 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9. So, here we will write 9. Students, any problem in addition without regrouping? No? So, students, I am going to start addition with regrouping. So, start students, regrouping of numbers. When we have more than 9 ones, they are regrouped into 10s and 1s. Regrouping makes it easier to add numbers. Let us consider 15 ones. See, here it is 15 ones. We know that 10 ones is equals to 110. See, here 10 ones, 10 ones is equals to 110. So, if 15 ones is equals to 10 plus 5 is equals to 110 plus 5 ones. 110 and 5 ones plus 5 ones. 110 is carried over and added to the tens column. So, students start addition with regrouping. And here I have given you one example to do. So, what you have to do students? We can easily add three one digit numbers by arranging them in column. So, what we will do here? We will make a column here. Tens, ones. So, what we will do students? First of all, we will arrange these numbers. So, 6, 4 and 
3 see students the number can be added by adding first two numbers so first two numbers means 6 plus 4 so 6 plus 4 is equals to 6 7 8 9 10 so 10 and after that we will add the third number so 10 plus 3 so 10 plus 3 is equals to students very good 13 so here we will write 3 and 1 carry over at the 10th place and here it is 0 so we will write 1 at the 10th place so 10 plus 3 is equals to 30 so students thus 6 plus 4 plus 3 is equals to 30 so students these numbers can be added using a number line so i am giving you this with the help of number line so students start addition on number line so add 6 4 and 3 students start from 0 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and here it is 4 so we have to move 4 steps 1 step 2 steps 3 steps 4 steps so 6 plus 4 is equals to 10 here 6 plus 4 is equals to 10 now add 3 so again we have to move 3 steps 1 step 2 steps 3 steps so 10 plus 3 is equals to 30 so student sum is equals to 30 6 plus 4 is equals to 10 10 plus 3 is equals to 13 so students today i have taught you addition of one digit number and with regrouping and without regrouping now i am giving you homework to do students write down your homework so your homework is worksheet 3.1 question number A, B and C. Page number 20. 